Hello, my name's Anthony McCarthy. Drum roll, please. Or is that drumsticks? That's right. We're going to be doing bacon wrapped drumsticks with a ricotta herb stuffing. Chicken is the number one consumed protein in Canada. And on average, each Canadian consumes about 34 kilograms of chicken in a year. Let's make some bacon wrapped drumsticks. Before we get started on the recipe, uh, let's be sure we've got nice clean hands, clean equipment, uh, and the chickens come straight from the cooler. First, start with the ricotta stuffing. Step one, in a bowl, mix together ricotta cheese, garlic, herbs, and breadcrumbs. Season with salt and pepper and set aside. Okay, so I'm just gonna loosen the skin up around the chicken. And I'm gonna fill them. About a spoonful per leg. Just put under, under one section of the chicken. Pull that skin over and smooth it down. Just like so. And then we repeat that for all eight legs. Then tightly wrap a slice of bacon around the large end of the drumstick. Here was my pro tip with wrapping these. Taking the bacon, starting it up over the drumstick, and then roll. Keeps it a little bit tighter on there. I'm often asked by our guests how the chicken we serve was raised. They are often concerned about the use of growth hormones and steroids. Let's hear from a Saskatchewan poultry veterinarian about just this topic. I am the poultry extension veterinarian for the province of Saskatchewan. So I work with producers throughout the province to produce turkey and chicken and eggs for human consumption. So those products end up in the grocery store. A question I sometimes get is, are hormones and steroids used in chicken production by farmers? And the answer to this question is no. So it's actually quite exciting the improvements we've had over the past few decades with respect to chicken production. In 1960, it actually took about 12 weeks, so three months, to produce a broiler chicken to the weight of 2.2 kilograms, which would be market weight. Today, we can do that in half the time. So it only takes about six weeks to produce a chicken to market weight, which is about 4.8 pounds or 2.2 kilograms. Now, I think there are a few reasons for these improvements. Number one would be improved genetic stock. Number two would be improvements in housing and equipment, such as improved barn construction and improved ventilation in barns. Number three would be improved management, such as vaccinating the broiler breeders, like the broiler parents, and also improved sanitation and biosecurity in barns. And number four would be improved nutrition. And this would be with respect to feed ingredients being more consistent, as well as diet formulation, as well as type of feed, such as pelleted feeds. Welcome back, let's get cooking. Step three, mix together the mustard and canola oil and brush it on the chicken. Step four, bake in the oven, 30 to 40 minutes at 350 degrees Fahrenheit, or until cooked through and the meat thermometer registers 165 degrees Fahrenheit. Step five, take it all out of the oven and use a meat thermometer to ensure the chicken is fully cooked. Step six, taste and discuss how to serve it. I hope everyone has fun trying this recipe and that you enjoy it as much as I do. Thanks so much for watching.